What's the last 24 hours been like for you? Roller coaster. A little bit of a roller coaster. A little up and down here and there, you know. Shocking. Just very shocking just to see it happen. But I mean, it's a business. Just, just like it happened a couple years ago. It's a business, so, you know. You just got to keep pushing forward. You mentioned a couple years ago. What is that like to have to go through this twice in your college career? Uh, I mean, I didn't expect to go through it once, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, twice is pretty, you know, difficult. The first time was difficult. The second time was just as difficult. So, I mean... Just gotta, you know, keep pushing, keep playing football, you know, because that's what I was brought here to do, you know. Um, so just keep, that's what they want me to do, just keep playing football, that's it. Can you talk about that meeting and what Gary said to you? Uh, it was, it was just, you know, he just, just told her straight up that he wasn't gonna be our coach for the rest of the year, you know, and uh, it's pretty shocking, you know, nobody nobody in the room expected that to happen, you know, I just, I, I honestly thought like maybe some other change was gonna be happening, I didn't think anybody was gonna like leave, you know, so it was just, it was just, Crazy to see that just unfolding like 15 minutes in front of my eyes. Can you talk about your relationship with Gary? That's, you know, Gary, Coach Anderson has helped me and my mom through a lot. You know, I've gone through a lot of personal battles that, you know, not a lot of people know about. And he's been there in my corner the whole time, you know, and so he's been just great to me. You know, he could have, you know, kicked me out of the program after when he first got here just to clean the house, but he didn't, you know, he gave me opportunity, you know, prove my worth and stuff. So, you know, I just have to thank him for that one. Have you been able to speak with him since that meeting yesterday? Uh, no, nah, not really. You know, I, I, I kind of want to let him, you know, figure everything out because he has a lot of stuff, you know, he has to do and, you know, he's going to be getting hit up by a lot of people. I don't want to have to, you know, bother him or nothing like that, but I will give him a call, you know, probably later this week, probably try to see if, see him or something like that because, you know, I mean, it's just the best thing to do because it's just like, that's, that's my guy right there. What would you say to him? Love him. Miss you. You know, I mean, I understand it's a business, you know, and that, uh, I uh, wish things could have been different. You know, wish we could have, you know, won more games for him. Do you have a clear sense as to why this had to happen in the middle of the season as opposed to after the season was over? 